Hello, I'm Nancy. I'm going to go do a very quick stir fry of uh, the prawns, which are very clean and uh, divin. And I've uh, seasoned it with some, uh, um, with no pepper yet, just some soya sauce. Okay. I'm going to use uh, cracked black pepper at the end. Over here, I have um, one teaspoon of um, tapioca flour, which I mix with some water. That will be at the end of the dish. I have here some fresh mushroom, garlic, ginger, um, some uh, shallot, um, some uh, Spanish onions, and some chopped small red chilies. Over here, I have chives, organic chives. <coughs> Excuse me, and some snow peas. Right. I've heated up my pan and just add in a little bit of olive oil. About uh, less than a tablespoon. Then when that is hot, I have ginger too. I have some ginger here. I just add in, sorry I have to switch this on. In my ginger, my ginger and garlic. Give it a quick fry. When it's nice and uh, slightly brown, I will add in my Spanish onion. Can you brown onion? Yeah. On a high heat. So they are nice and soft, thin and soft. Then I add in my uh, mushrooms, other fresh uh, mushrooms. Just like the mushrooms. Fresh means um, they are not the dried mushrooms. You can use the dried ones, but I need to work time to, to soak it. So this one is fresh, and but it's, it's frozen, okay? You can buy it from the Asian shop. Then, what I do is, I don't want it to be too hot. The chili is coming out. Snow peas. They are just nice and a little bit green and tender. Do not overcook the skin because if you do overcook, they become yellow. It's horrible. Horrible taste. So you just want to cook this. So it's just cook. If the pan gets too dry, you can uh, drizzle in some water. Water. Just look in a little bit of water. Or you can use a wok cover to cover for a short while if you like. But there's not too much uh, vegetables here, so that's okay. Right, at this stage now, I can add in my and my rest of my herbs and I throw in my prawns as well. Do not overcook the prawns. You can serve this uh, beautiful dish with rice. Any steamed rice, Chinese like jasmine rice, Indians like parboil rice. Um, lots of Asian countries eat rice. Uh, in China, 
they also grow rice, but not in China. The Chinese prefer bread because there's not a wheat grown there. Same as in India. The southern eat a lot of rice, and the northern Indians eat a lot of bread, naan and all that. It all depends on what's grown in your local area. Then you make use of those ingredients. Okay, that's almost ready now. I've got all my soy sauce in, so I don't have to add any more. Just to season the prawns, and uh, that should do. I also added uh, one teaspoon of sesame oil with prawns. Cook now. Looks really good. Now I want to cook just the prawns, and I do not want to overcook it. Just make sure it's on the heat, on high. Yet, do not overcook it. Because if you overcook prawns, you'll be like very tough, you know, protein in your prawns makes it very, very tough. It's very dense meat, prawns. So, it's a very nice seafood dish. Lots of mineral salts, protein, and vegetables all in a quite, quite balanced. Okay, when you see the prawns turning pink, when you see the tail turning red or pink, uh, it tells you that the prawns are cooked. So give it a few more stir. And to make it nice and moist, you just add in your Tapioca flour, water, just give it a stir, shrivel it brown, pan. And then we make the soup. Okay. Right, see it's ready. Have a look. It's nice.